You've heard a lot about the 322 method, but you haven't seen anybody show you how to build it in a live ad account. So let's fix that. Hi, I'm Charlie. Let me show you live inside of my Disruptor School ad account how to build it from scratch. What we're gonna do is build some video ads to help folks get a free download to a blueprint for Facebook ads to make it super easy, stable, and scalable so they don't have to worry about false promises from ad agencies that don't care about them or people that value silly things like audiences and cost caps, retargeting, and, well, ROAS. That being said, let's get to it. I'm gonna share my screen, show you every single step of the way inside of my ad account. Now, before we get started, we have to remember, we need three things in order to build our 322 method with. Three creatives, two primary texts, and two headlines. Now, if you wanna see how I've used AI to take a transcription of the video ads and turn it into killer copy based around Google search volume, Facebook engagement intent, and ultimately competition in the space as well as engagement rate, check out this video we had before and you'll see it step by step every step of the way. And it's damn near free. All right, that being said, let's get to it. In my one campaign setup, we're gonna add a second dynamic creative. We don't yet have control ads in this campaign and our first dynamic creative is already driving us results that are fantastic, that we love to see. So this new test we're gonna to run today is to see if we can help make this campaign even better when it comes to overall blended efficiency. Hey guys, real quick, if you wanna join an exclusive community and get regular lessons from me every single week, including live deep dives into the back ends of businesses and into ad accounts like your own, check out the first link in the description below. That being said, let's get back to it. So we're gonna call this Las Vegas, Hotel room, video, free ebook giveaway. It's our ad set, because that's our concept. I literally shot these videos that we're gonna use in this ads in this hotel room on this camera about 25 minutes ago. Now for our targeting, of course, we don't use any. It's not 2016 anymore. We're literally saying men, women, 18 plus in the United States. Now if you look here, we're not gonna select any manual placements because we want Facebook to use all of the tools we're giving it to allow the end user to have the best possible experience. So we meet not only the highest quality people, but we get them earlier in the feed and for a lower cost. Again, Facebook is our business partner. We're gonna work together and do great things. There's no reason that you need to micromanage the machine. And if you do, you're gonna get worse results. So with this, let's get to the ad level, get started, right? This is gonna be fun and super easy. All right, so now we're in the ad level. Now, of course, we'll keep the ad name. I like to just click on the preview. Why not see what we're doing while we're doing it? And we got our right Facebook page and our Instagram account, that's good. Creative source, we're gonna manually upload this, absolutely. Now, I know you love this video, but sadly, YouTube only has a like button. So go ahead and smash it aggressively with enthusiasm. And don't forget to ring the bell and subscribe so that you don't miss any other videos from this channel. That being said, let's finish this up. All right, so let's select these three videos. These are ours. I'm literally wearing the same shirt inside the same room because I shot these videos less than an hour ago. Now, the beautiful thing is we have three videos of the same concept. So they all have the same business objective. So they all target the same audience. Remember the ads do the targeting, which means they're all complementary, And we're letting Facebook not pick the best ad for whatever that ad does, but instead pick the best variations of the ads we're throwing up to deliver the overall best user experience for Facebook. And then whatever does best for our business, we're gonna keep live. Now, the last thing we have to do here to build this out is throw in some copy. Now, we already got the copy from another thing before. So we're just gonna copy and paste that from a doc and then hit publish. Now we're gonna upload the one, and then after that we're gonna hit add a text option, and we're gonna copy and paste the next one. Done. One headline, yep. Add a headline option, let's go here. This is a second headline, yep. Drop it in there, and we're done. Now this is the website we're driving people to. So let's go ahead and grab that and put that down in the website URL. 
Now remember, we are not using a description because nobody ever needs that. It doesn't even show up for most people. All it does is make a ton more variations of our ad, which makes us far less efficient. To drive this home, all we need is broad targeting so we're not paying extra to exclude good people from seeing our ads. We're using dynamic creative so that we can leverage AI and machine learning to let Facebook give the end user the best possible experience so that we can reach the highest quality people for the lowest possible price in a way that never fatigues and only ever gets better. Because remember, that machine learning is going to learn and improve over time. With that being said, our work here is basically done. We're gonna hit publish and we're off to the races. So there you go, from the guy that invented 322. How easy is that to build ads? And we're gonna actually leverage Facebook's machine learning and artificial intelligence. This ad is gonna get better over time. It's not ever gonna fatigue, it's only gonna appreciate. This is how you build money making efforts in Facebook. Now remember, we're not gonna measure the success of this ad set by its own metrics. We're gonna measure the impact it has on our campaign as a whole. And ultimately, what that does to our business's bottom line, especially with respect to additional site traffic and search volume and emails. Your entire ad account can be run by doing just that. And I'm not even gonna check this out other than for maybe my own curiosity's sake. For a few days, I probably won't even take action for a week. And that's basically it, we're done. So also, if you want the free ebook that we were building all of this ads to do, go check it out in the description down below. And if you want to find out more information below that, you're going to see how to enroll in Facebook Ads MBA program. Get one-on-one -on -one calls with me if you want to dive into your ad account and screen share with me and your business to help you see the success you deserve, get rid of the stress that you don't, and ultimately, scale your business with confidence. With that being said, YouTube thinks you might like a couple of these videos. Don't forget to hit that button. And until next time, I'll see you on the internet. Bye.